He's known around San Antonio as Mr. Eyes on Me. Yes, sir. That's what the community calls me. A master barber who fell in love with the work at a young age. Uh, my mom got me my first pair of clippers when I was 12. You may remember seeing Rudy in the news a couple of years back giving haircuts to the homeless. It was the most precious thing that I was able to do for somebody is making their day a lot better. Uh, These days, I like it. you can find him here. What you going to be doing here? At his new barber school. Taper fade. Taper fade. Yes, sir. Aptly named the Eyes on Me Barber. College. That shaver line, that's going to be the hardest one to get out, you know what I'm saying? He wants to share the value of giving back, teaching people how to cut hair with style and to use that talent to give back to others. And I've been trying to teach him, like, hey, you have to give back to those who are in need. And it seems to be working. The students are lining up to learn from one of the best. Students like 22-year-old Rafael Ramirez. I've always, like, heard of Rudy. He's a big exp uh, inspiration to a lot of people. I just kind of fade that out. And 26-year-old Amanda Reyna. Right when I was losing my flame to, to cut hair, uh, Rudy opened up his shop. Anything you're struggling on that you... Tapers. Tapers. Yeah. But it's not just the people on the outside Rudy wants to help. His students learn how to master the art of hair and the art of business. Now we're teaching people how to invest in their money to be a business owner or to increase their value as a barber. Making a difference one haircut at a time. One haircut at a time. And what good would a visit to Eyes On Me be without getting a little work done? The worry, David, would definitely make you look better than Ryan Wolf himself. David Norris, Fox News at 9.